Hi, ma'am. Good afternoon, ma'am. How are you, ma'am? Hi, Kanesh. Good afternoon. I'm very well. How are you? Can you see me? Uh, your video is dark. It's dark. Okay, give me yeah. a second. Okay, I'll try and put the light on. Okay, perfect. So, uh, how is your day going? Ma'am, it is great. Superb. Going, going superb. Awesome. Very good. And how's the weather? Ma'am, it is very ra rainy today. Very rainy. So, what idiom can we use for that? Pigs are flying. No, no, no. Not pigs. Uh, cats and dogs are running. Hmm. It's raining cats and dogs. Okay. Uh, cats and dogs are raining. No, the idiom is it is raining cats and dogs. So you would just use it as it is. Okay. Yeah, perfect. Very good. Uh, now let's start our class. Before we start our class, how are your exams going? Ma'am, it is fine. Tomorrow I have my GK exam. Okay. And you're all set for it? Yeah, set. Perfect. Very good. So did you do the homework? Yes. Okay, so a uh, formal conversation and the I mean, informal one. Hmm. Yeah, so I'm starting with the formal. Hmm. Good morning, sir. I am Kanish Kroshan from Delhi. I wanted to register a FIR for a robbery at my house. They took all the uh, they took all my they took all the stuff in my house. Sir, please help me. And after this robbery, I am very scared. Please help me. Regards, Kanish Krasha. This was the formal. Now this was call. such a short formal conversation. Yeah, ma'am. But... Because I was not able to think that what should I add in the thing. Okay. So, okay. All right. So, it has to be a conversation between two people. Yes. But fine. Okay. Next one. Okay. Yeah. Informal. Hi, bro. What is going on? How are you? Bro, I wanted to ask, uh, I wanted to ask you that, can I stay at your house? Hmm. Because last night, uh, because last night a robbery was done at my house. So my father has registered uh, a FIR, but the policeman is doing investigation. So that's why I am asking you, please reply till uh, uh, Till the afternoon. Okay. Very good. They awesome. Hmm. Okay. So this is more or less like a message or an email. <laughs> okay. Uh, today we are going to have a conversation. So I will also be engaging. Now you said a robbery was done. Yeah. Okay. Basically a robbery is a crime. So uh, what you're saying is correct. A robbery was like a robbery happened or a robbery took place at my house. Okay, this is how we use it because it's a crime. It's not a good thing. So you will, it is something that you have not willingly, uh, it is something that you don't willingly want to happen to you. It has just happened. Now a robbery happened or a robbery took place. Okay, so you can use that word. Okay. Uh, now we are going to do a semi-formal conversation. Okay. Uh, let me write the topic in the chat box. Have I already written it? No, no. Okay, here. Now, semi formal. Apartment for the last, for the past one year, recently, a new, a new neighbor has moved in the loud parties several times a week. Have a conversation about this with your landlord. We are in complain about the noise. Okay, so I have to complain about the no uh, noise that a lot of noise is coming here. Hmm. <clears throat> okay, this is a formal one. This is a semi formal one. It is not a yo bro one, but it is not a respected sir. Middle. Middle. So Next. hi. Dear, yeah, makes semi formal between informal and okay, uh, so we have to start. Hmm. Okay, uh, we can think that we are on call, yeah, or probably we've just met. Okay, hi, landlord, sir. What do okay. I say? Tell me his name, I will say as his name. 
just say hi. Uh, okay, ma. Uh, I thought. Okay. Hi, Ayansh, sir. I just wanted to uh, ask you that can you take any action for our neighbors because they are doing uh, they are making a lot of noise and my family is complaining me that tell the landlord to uh, tell the neighbors to not do a lot of noise they speak very loud they <clears throat> they play okay. their song very loud and they just laugh very loud they talk very loud so they are not they are not feeling that uh, uh, others are also living here they, they are just living like they are only in the society so okay. please take any action on this thing because this is not a good thing and my uh, child is also not able to uh, concentrate on concentrate on his online classes okay so now i'm the landlord now since this is a conversation it goes both way okay yeah so i'll say uh, hi kanish how are you i'm fine thank you landlord uh, how are you i'm very well thank you okay so i hear that your family is uh, that your family is complaining and you are facing this issue so uh, since when has this been happening past one week past one week and did you try talking to them no not yet okay uh, so have you introduced yourself to them yet no we have never met or talked okay because the thing is that uh, these people they have not uh, rented the apartment uh, they have bought it from me okay so the uh, thing is that i i'm not you know, authorized to you know say anything else to them because now they have uh, bought the flat from me so i'm not their landlord anymore so i think it would be best if you can introduce yourself to them and then you can speak to them what do you think but this is not the manner to live here like if they are living so they should just be normal you're right they should not they should have good manners and they should respect the or you just uh, you just uh, tell us that if there is any other house in the society we will just ship there because my my child my child has a lot of friends so that's why she uh, he doesn't wants to go uh, in any other apartment so he doesn't want us... to go he doesn't he, want he de- uh, he doesn't wants to go in want any wants to want he... to go huh. he doesn't want to go in any other apartment so that's why you just show us any rented house in this apartment okay i will show you another rented house but do you really want to change your base because of them we can try talking to them probably they will understand no, the concern we don't we don't want to talk to them you don't want to talk to them why because they will just say that you are living here on rent they will not just take this seriously that's why you really think so <laughs> yeah why would they do that okay we can try speaking to them do you want to uh, come with me so that you can express your concern to them and i can come and accompany you no no you just talk to them i don't want to talk to them you don't want to talk to them. okay no. all right i will see what best i can do and we'll find a solution okay okay bye all right okay and uh, see you take care bye bye same to you bye bye ma'am in between when you uh, said see you bye bye your voice was like a Uh, that ghost like a ghost why like, see you bye bye like this it really? happens from zoom okay yeah, sometimes so. sometimes it happens with zoom yes yeah, sometimes that happens probably some network thing or technical <laughs> thing okay all right it now can it funny it was pretty funny yeah, i'm sure yeah when it happens it, it's pretty funny yeah. but mom this uh, semi formal one i didn't like like not that enjoyable not that enjoyable okay but it's important to know 
when you have to talk to somebody in a semi formal setting it's important to know how to speak so we have so to practice your place is not training what at your place it is not training no <laughs> yeah you can see i am wearing full sleeves shirt because yeah. of, it is raining from morning 5 4 am and till now it is happening till now okay. yeah even at my place it has stopped right now but it was raining uh, heavily just uh, i think seven or eight so you see but there it is raining a lot i really can't see yeah, uh, much but okay yeah. i can i can just see the door gate. okay it's your balcony gate perfect okay kanish so uh, yeah now i want to ask you something kanish personally okay not i'm not talking about your parents now yes. just you as a person how much money do you have not what your parents have given you but what have you made like how much money do you have not what have you made but now let's say let's say somebody gives you money on your birthday sometimes they give money or, or you... something like sometimes only they give money on birthday and you and even else but most of the time people give <coughs> gifts like uh, okay we can say the remote control car these things no small gifts do you prefer gifts or do you prefer money i don't know i'm happy with all the things that's very nice that's very nice now uh, <laughs> how much money do you want to have in this entire lifetime have you ever thought no not right now good you should not stress yourself with that but now i have a jam topic for you okay. which is if i had a million dollars to give away okay if i had to give a, away yeah what if would i, I do a, yeah million yeah. dollars to spare yeah 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 yeah, yeah. you if got I, it okay yeah. Uh, yeah if i had a million dollars to give away so what will i do i give uh, 50 50000 to uh, everyone uh, to to whom i can give but i will make them do a task that you have to climb that thing you have to clean that thing first then i will give like some conditions then i will give this much of money to that okay person. so basically it's uh, you'll ask them to perform a task and then you will reward them with this money yeah you will finish a million dollars like that Yeah, slowly, 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 slowly. Whole life. Whole life, fifty thousand. But what is the uh, what is the uh, thing? Like for example, now no, you will get fifty thousand every. Whole life will not. It yeah, won't really last. Yeah. It would take. Unless I you invest it. Month. Unless you invest it. Yeah, because if in a country like India, where the population is so much. I have some tears from that. No, not. I cannot. Uh, Same you can you can you can claim it i by this i just mean if if i had a million dollars to give away it means i just have you don't have to uh, give it away to people you just have a million dollars to spare so you can do anything with it i can just spare it yeah i mean it's 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 just some But extra money you see, have see see i can um, buy anything from that na no? ha huh, you can buy whatever you want okay you so i will buy some shares which market is going up in what market okay stock market ha huh. so if the market is going up you'll buy shares no like uh, for which company like uh, okay h c f is going up h d f c ha okay so i will buy its share like that only it happens yeah yeah no no please be confident in whatever you are saying you are right you have the right mentality just be confident don't think like yeah so you want to buy in something that is going to grow which is correct yes what else are you going to do uh, next thing i will uh, help the uh, poor people yes i will make them <clears throat> live in a rented house like if they will be on the road i will give them money and i will say that you can spend this on your groceries 
and your works but not something uh, not hmm. anything for wasted not anything for wasted uh, okay what else would you do I'm so you want to be, yeah i'm putting it on so you would want to create a self running model for them like where they don't have to ask for money from anybody else no if they want to ask anyone else they can but from my side i will give on your side you are going to give you are going to help them what else what you finish else? it by charity like helping poor people and so uh, i will spend uh Invested. 500 k dollars in charity and 500 dollars on me 500 k dollars on me yeah i was like 500 dollars on yourself and 500 k on charity you're so giving <laughs> okay but you'll you spend 500 k on yourself and 500 k on charity okay fair enough so you would do a lot of things right when you have million dollars you would buy all you want you would uh, probably play whatever video we have a, like a good car which you can drive and a good house drive so you should not just buy one more that uh, that you should no 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 some people who like i have a lot of money so i will buy one more car i will buy one more huh. house you are right that is no need yeah that is true that is true but what if now let's say uh, let's say you have a million dollars right Now imagine if you have a thousand rupees. So exactly five hundred k, you would do this. Five hundred k, you would do that. That money would uh, actually just exhaust itself. Wouldn't you want that from that million dollars, at least half a million dollars, you invest it as such that that money is making more money for you, and the rest no, you can spend. No, from that money only, I'm buying the shares, and yeah. the shares will go up. I will sell them. And I will get more of it. Yes, like very good. Like if I buy it, uh, if I bought the share for thirteen uh, thousand, mm. so then it will uh, rise. And while rising, I will sell it. So uh, I will get more. Like I will get twenty six thousand. So you make a ten thousand uh, profit. Let's see. Yeah, What will you do with lot. the profit? Yeah, it's a lot. What will you do with the profit? Save it. Nothing much. You will reinvest it, or you will save it. No, I will reinvest. Uh, then, when uh, all the shares are finished, on which I have already spent money. Okay. All right. Perfect. Very good. Then I will so just uh, again. Uh, what is that? Again, put some money on shares. Like this only, it will go and I will earn. Yeah, it. so you keep the cycle of investment going on. You keep on investing, right? It's very important to invest your money. It's uh, just saving it alone is also not going to help. If it is just in your bank account, you have to keep, you know, uh, investing also, which is good. So I'm sure that is the strategy you will follow with the money you're going to start getting with YouTube now, and your hundred dollars. <laughs> when is it coming? September twenty or twenty three, like this only. Awesome, very good. After very my good. exams, my exam will end on twentieth of September. Then I will get a gift from YouTube. <laughs> wow, that's awesome, right? Kanish, kind of very yeah, good. Yeah, it is similar, matching, matching. Similar. Okay. Now, uh, let me ask you, Kanish, kind of, uh, in your school, did you have a canteen or cafeteria? Oh, on this thing, we had a debate also. <laughs> yeah. But uh, and you agree with not having a cafeteria in yeah. the classroom also, right? Because it's important to have your mother's uh, nutritious food, right? Okay, yes, <laughs> perfect. But now imagine you walked into some cafeteria one day for lunch. Now, now I think so. We should not do this. Now I am pretty bored from this. Now you're pretty bored from this. Now you want to play the sushi spell game. I'm guessing. Uh, yeah, we can play. Yeah, that's a must. I didn't huh? thought of that, but we can play. I love that game. You love it. Okay, we'll do this, and then you take this for your homework. Uh, Only just read it is, once. It's a storytelling. You walk into the cafeteria only for lunch, only to discover that the room is far away, and again, so what is the reason about, and how are you going to uh, take this for it? 
Did you understand the meaning? I think I will not be able to do because I don't know of what arrangement is going on. Marriage arrangement, car arrangement, which arrangement is going on. Okay, okay. The word is argument. Okay, now understand. You walk into the cafeteria one day for lunch only to discover that your two best friends are in an argument. I was reading wrong. Yeah. What is the argument about and how are you going to help them solve it? You okay, just have to imagine. I'm fine. I'm into it. I Understood? thought it was arrangement. No, no, no. It's an argument. Understood? Yeah. Okay, now let me find you the sushi spell. But there is a trick to sushi spell, okay? Now you can't just keep making words like dad and everything. To know these no, words. No, ma'am. I will just give you 50 plus, uh, 50 plus uh, points. That I is don't my... want points. Oh, that's your goal. Okay. First game, you can do that. Second goal, you have to learn some new words. You have to make new words, right? Yeah. Okay. Got it. So you can start. Yeah, quickly just... Uh, First, the me... sound will come. Dun, 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 dun. No, it didn't come. Dad, I can wait for that word. Hmm? Nothing, ma'am. Okay, oh. dad, cold boy, little. All right. Okay, now let me play one game, okay? Okay, fine. And you try and look for the meaning. You. Now you will make those words which I don't know, and you will then give me the meanings of it. No, now you cannot. You, now you will get 10 points. You made a word. Oh, you got okay, you can also help me out, all right? Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I got a word. Okay. Ma the spelling of ma'am is different. Uh, it has apostrophes, so this won't work. Wow. Okay, no problem. Okay, can uh, you mom? Yeah. yeah. Uh, Okay, let me make one. Yeah, make. Okay, I'll make another one. My name is going so fast. Okay, now you make. Your chance. What is this word? 
Are you trying to make it? <laughs> okay, no problem. <laughs> The exam is even starting point. Okay, now what words do we not know? Quill, freed, glee. Go, uh, quail. Oh, why did, how did you zoom in? How did I? I escaped zoom. it. No problem. So no, now, no. what is the quail I'm showing you? It's a bird. Okay. Uh, people eat the meat also of this bird. Okay. This is a quail and it's okay. very delicious is what people say. Are you a vegetarian? No. You're not a vegetarian. Okay, so this is a quail. Uh, you can probably have it if you want to. And I what was the other? I just ate chicken and fish and mutton. Nothing else. Okay, now let's uh, Glee find out. TV channel. It was a TV show called also, but now Glee. What does Glee mean? Great, delight. Uh, happiness, delight. joy. Basically, a lot of happiness. Okay, Glee. What was the other word we made? Fret. F-R-E-T. Okay. What is the meaning of fret? Don't fret over this. Don't worry over this. Worry, okay. Huh? Don't fret. Don't worry. Okay, understood? Ma'am, sushi, please. Sushi, sushi please. again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sushi. Sushi. Okay, after that, we have a listening activity, okay? Yeah, I'm always ready for everything. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this sound I like. Take the remote control. Okay. Make big words. I need a L. You need what? L. But I think I can make another word also. I don't know why I'm not able to find the words in this. What word have you made? P, green, job, and God. Okay. All yeah, because the words, like I was not able to find the words for that. Okay, no issues. Now let's do our uh, listening activity. Yeah. Ready English console, I think that name. British console. Uh, British console. Okay. British console. Yes. Okay, ready? Yep. So first we are going to just, we're going to do this activity before we listen, okay? 
So what is the main course? What is the dessert and what is the beverage or a drink out of these four, out of all of these? Can you tell me? Okay, let's say water. What is it? Main course, dessert or drink? Drink. Orange juice? Drink. Apple juice. Coca-Cola. Apple juice, Coca Cola, uh, all drink. Hmm. Now tell me the other ones. What are some dessert, main? Dessert, uh, dessert is chocolate cake mm -hmm. uh, and ice cream. Mm -hmm. uh, banana cake. Mm -hmm. Now what is apple tart? Apple tart. It's a tart. Tart is a dessert which I show you. Uh, it's a baked dessert. Okay. Okay. So this is a tart. Oh, oh okay. First time I saw this. Wait, you must have seen tarts in bakeries. This is a tart. You can have it for so many different things. Okay, ma'am. That's a tart. Okay. Got okay, it? Have you eaten uh, it in this? Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Now let's do main course. These all are main course. Four cheese pizza, cheeseburger. All of these are main courses, right? Chicken curry and rice and seafood salad and bread. All right, perfect. Now let's do our uh, listening activity. All correct. All are correct. Ready? This is all main course. This, this would be about uh, some that you charged a lot. I think so like that only. You've done this one? No, from the bill I am judging it. Okay, this is the menu. Yeah. Let's see. Next, please. What would you like? Can I have a burger, please? A cheeseburger or double cheeseburger? Double cheeseburger, please. Mm -hmm. Anything else? Yeah, I'd like some banana cake. Would you like a drink? Yes. Can I have an apple juice, please? Okay. So, that's one double cheeseburger, one banana cake, and an apple juice. What's your table number? Table three. How much is that? Uh, that's eight pounds thirty-seven, please. Um, here you are. Thank you. That's ten pounds and one pound 63 change next please this okay all right so now uh let's check our understanding did you understand yeah okay so what does he choose for his main course double cheeseburger what would you choose for your main course I don't know. What is it? Banana cake. Okay. The drink? Apple juice. Let's see. Very good. So easy. Hmm. Now let's put the questions in the order that we hear them in. Okay. First, I don't remember. What would you like? What the first one is? What would you like? Yeah. What What do we do? In, what do we like? Uh, what would we? What would so we the like? first. So now let's see the girl. What all questions did she ask in the order of? So her I own? have to uh, make this in an order. Yeah. Okay. Let me make this in an order. Perfect. Done. Finish. Select, click on it. <gasps> okay. No problem. It should be here and here. Hmm. Uh, so answer. First, it would be anything okay. else. The, yeah. Perfect. Okay. No problem. So, uh, that's more or less it for our class for today.
Did you understand everything? Yeah, you performed ma'am. It well. was a superb class. It was a superb class. Very good, Kanish. Now tell me something. Uh, have you been? Did you get a chance to read adjectives or uh, ad? What would we uh, do in the last class? Adverbs. Adverbs. I didn't do it until now. Okay. Because of your exam. Yeah. After okay. Exams, I'll do. Okay, we'll do it. And also, Kanish, uh, I know of it already, but I'm just going to ask you because I have to delete some videos. Your dad is oh, down. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's all done. Yeah. Perfect. My so father. He's doing it. Perfect. Very good. So now, Kanish, your homework is going to be what? One is going to be the storytelling topic. Other is we have to find some new words. Remember three new words we learned today: glee, quail. And one more was there. Fret. What is quail? Quail. Quail is the name of a bird. Very good. Uh, what is the meaning of glee? This is for happiness, and uh, greet is for like uh, when you are in a bad situation, so you uh, worry fret. about something. Yeah, fret, not greet. Fret. fret. Don't fret over something. Fret means to worry. Don't worry. Okay. Okay. Understand? Now you just write these words in that feedback form. Okay, I'll write the words in the feedback form. Uh, glee, fret, and quail. And then I want you for your homework. Also, you need to find out some more new words. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Fine. Perfect. Okay, Ganesh. So that's it for our class for today. And I will see you in the next class. Take care and have a nice day. Okay. Thank you, ma'am. Bye bye. Bye. Enjoy the weather and enjoy your lunch. Bye bye. Same Take to care. you. See you. Bye bye.